we all get a return from the stock market in the long run, the returns created by American business. Now, let's say for the purpose of argument that that's an 8% return. That's what we all share. There's no way around it. We, you know, in an 8% market, we don't share 8.5%, nor do we share 6.5%, whatever it might be. We share 8. So that is the gross return that's created by American business. But we in the markets get the net return after the insanely high costs of financial intermediation. And those can be as much as, say, 2% a year. And it's very high. It's not only management fees, administrative fees, marketing costs, uh, turnover costs. Funds are constantly buying and selling securities. And it turns out to be about 2% less than the market return. So we all earn 8%, say, we all get 6%, and which people don't think nearly enough about. Over an investment lifetime, uh, we, we, are, we put up 100% of the capital, we take 100% of the risk, and we get about 30% of the market's long-term return.